Sunday Swap is now live, which is fantastic if you are using the swap function of the decks. There are a couple of trading pairs that you can now use, such as Sunday Ada, Liquid Finance Ada, World Mobile Ada, and Card Starter Ada. And as the Sunday Swap team highlighted, there is going to be a lot of congestion initially, as everybody is going to go and try and use this deck. Some of your transactions could take hours, if not days, to go through. So something I think you are going to hear a lot about is trying to manage your slippage. This is a concept that I'm going to go over and explain in this video. Imagine you go into the shop and you want to buy 10 apples and the price in the shop is 1 euro or 1 dollar or whatever. So for 10 apples that is going to cost you 10 euro, that's no problem. But all of a sudden there is news that eating apples will make you live to 200 years old. The price of apples skyrocket. Now the price of an apple will set you back 100 euro. By the time I bring my apples up to the counter to buy them, it is now going to cost me 1000 euro. When you are trading on a decentralized exchange, the price that you were quoted when you are trying to swap one token for another may be different to the price that your order actually gets executed at. This is because there is a small time lag. This is essentially what slippage is. And because what we already know about Sunday Swap and the amount of congestion that we are going to experience, I think slippage is probably going to become a bit of a problem for a while. On a DEX also, the smart contract tries to keep a balance of liquidity between each trading pair. So for the trading pair of say ADA and World Mobile, it is going to try and keep a balance of 50-50. Let's say now I come along with my 1 million ADA and I try and swap it all for World Mobile tokens. All of a sudden the liquidity of the market is completely out of balance. There's a heap of ADA flood of the market and a shortage of World Mobile tokens. To try and offset this, very large orders will always have a higher slippage applied to them. To avoid these situations of low liquidity. On Sunday Swap, you can actually set a maximum amount of slippage that you are willing to accept. So I'm just on the swap section here of the decks. So I just have a small bit of ADA here that I'm just going to use as an example. So if I wanted to swap some ADA for Sunday tokens, what I can do here is come up to the little settings cog here in the top hand right corner. I can set my slippage tolerance to anything I want. So I can set it to uh, say 1.25. But if I set it to 0.1% here, they say your transaction might fail. So that is probably too low to go with. So you will have to try and balance it out here. So if you go too low, your transaction will probably fail. But then if you go too high, you could end up with a much worse rate than you had planned. So that is probably something that you need to try and balance out over the next couple of days especially. I hope that all made sense. Best of luck with your trading and using of the decks. If anybody has any questions or anything, please let me know in the comment section.